Gravity. It's one of the most familiar forces in our daily lives, but what most of us think we know about it is only part of the story. When we imagine gravity, we picture it as a force that pulls things down. Apples dropping from trees, raindrops falling from the clouds, us standing firmly on the ground. But over a century ago, Albert Einstein shattered this simple view and revealed something far stranger. Let's rewind to Isaac Newton. He realized that all objects with mass attract each other, and he described this attraction with elegant equations that predicted how planets orbited the sun and how we could travel to the moon. For centuries, his ideas worked so well that we relied on them to explore space and build some of our most important technologies. But as scientists looked more closely, cracks began to appear. Why did starlight curve around massive objects like the sun during a solar eclipse? Why did satellites in orbit experience tiny differences in time? Newton's laws couldn't quite explain it all. Enter Einstein, who turned everything on its head. Gravity, he said, isn't really a force at all. Instead, it's all about shape, specifically the shape of space and time. Massive objects like Earth and the Sun actually bend the very fabric of space-time around them. This warping creates the effect we feel as gravity. Imagine placing a heavy ball in the center of a giant rubber sheet. It dips in the middle, and when you roll a smaller ball nearby, it spirals towards the center. That's what happens with planets and stars. They travel along curved paths carved out by gravity's distortion of space-time. Einstein's insight changed how we see the universe, helping us build accurate GPS, predict black holes, and understand the cosmos. So next time you feel the pull of gravity, remember, you're actually following invisible curves in the architecture of reality itself, and there's still so much more to uncover.